Hello, ho, ho, everyone. Drum tech drummer and YouTube educator Kenny Sherritt's coming to you with a quick stocking stuffer shout out video for five products that have been absolutely killing it for me in my online teaching, practice, and YouTube video creation drum studio. And I'm doing this video in hopes that it helps you find the perfect gift for the drummer on your holiday gift list, y'all. Now, the first product up is the Rogers Hi-Hat Clutch, and I'm so glad this thing is back in the game, y'all. From here, it looks like a normal hi-hat clutch, but when you flip it over, it is actually a pops clutch instead of a screw clutch that allows you to pop off a cymbal super easy, put it off to the side, grab another cymbal, pop it on, and have it ready for performance or packing at the flick of a wrist, y'all. And this has been absolutely essential for me for when I swap from video creation and recording sessions into online teaching sessions where I use these cows and quiet on the set cymbals for a quiet teaching experience in the household so my neighbors aren't mad, my wife isn't mad. It's been absolutely essential, and I know this hi-hat clutch is gonna be essential at my gigs super quick. And speaking of swapping cymbals super quick, the next product in my list is No Nut Cymbal Sleeves and the, their companion Sim Rings. Now, No Nut Cymbal Sleeves are just like a normal, you know, cymbal sleeve that goes on, screws on, except it's a little bit taller, a little bit thicker, and allows you to pop cymbals on or off super quick and again, this has been essential for me when I'm running between a video shoot and some lessons to be able to swap out cymbals quickly. And if you're worried about sway or losing your felts at the end of the night after a gig, that's what the sim rings are for, y'all. Just slide them right on, have them hit about to the desired height, and boom, any sway is controlled. And at the end of the night, once you pop your cymbals off, you can pop these back on, and your felt goes nowhere, and then you spend your time hanging out with your band because you're done with packing your gear rather than sitting there staring at them all angry while they're hanging out with everyone going, wish you didn't have to spend all these wing nuts, y'all. Uh, I know they're gonna be awesome on my gigs because they've been awesome here in the studio. Now, speaking of studios, uh, the next product I'm talking about will help you get a classic 70s Motown studio snare sound anywhere, anytime, and that is the big fat snare drum donut, y'all. Now, while I'm absolutely adamant about students learning how to tune their drum or drummers learning how to tune the drum for the sound they want, Sometimes it takes accoutrements to get that sound, and you can use some of these to help get a great fat back snare sound live. So you can go from an arena snare to a fat back snare to arena snare, all at the flick of a wrist. And speaking of flick of the wrist, my next tool is the Ahead Multi-Tool, man, for drummers, man. It has four sizes of Allen wrenches, it's got two different sizes of Phillips screws, a flathead screw, and a drum key tool that allows you to torque on things or untorque things by using the full wrist twist without having to do with a little drum key and kind of hurting your hands. You got this for a little extra power. And it's on a sleek pocket size package that fits right inside of your stick bag and fits right inside of an oh so woolly stocking. And speaking of oh so woolly, y'all, the last gift on my little list is not really a stocking stuffer gift, but it's a pretty fairly priced gift that I'm sure any drummer on the list would love, and that is a head snare bag with a nice oh-so-woolly interior, y'all. But what makes this one super awesome is that it's actually custom designed for the Rogers Dynasonic Snare. Now, I use the Dynasonic Snare these days almost exclusively, and it has a snare rail system, a one-of-a-kind snare rail system on the bottom of the snare that allows the snare to get unparalleled snare sensitivity and snare sound. But a lot of times when I looked at those drums when I was a kid and seen them in the studio or other drummers had them, the snare rail was broken off and the bottom rail that protects the snare rail was also broken off. And that's a shame, it's because they didn't have one of these. This is an oh so willy line cha uh, channel that protects the frame, the snare rail frame on the Rogers snare drum. It allows you to protect the drum with a woolly case that packs up nicely, y'all. So again, if your drummer on your list has a Dynasonic and doesn't have one of these cases, I'm pretty sure they're gonna love you and say, oh my God, best gift ever, y'all. It's a phenomenal case and I recommend it highly. So I hope this Stocking Stuffer shout out video has helped give you some great ideas for the drummer on your holiday gift list. And if you're wondering to yourself, hey, I wonder what Kenny would love for a gift this Christmas. Please remember, a subscription to my YouTube drum tuning and tech channel is the gift that keeps on giving, y'all. And if you enjoy my channel, Please hit the donate button on my YouTube channel this holiday season to help me keep making drum tuning, drum technique, and drum tip videos for you that show you the tips, techniques, and tunings I use for artists such as Stevie Wonder, Rihanna, Janet Jackson, Train, Elvis Costello, Melissa Etheridge, and so many more that I've been blessed to work with, y'all. So I hope this video helped you, and y'all have a happy holiday season.